first AC invented in 1902 by Willis Carrier to control humidity in a publishing house. Ancient Egyptians used AC by hanging wet reeds in windows to cool incoming breezes. The White House got AC in 1930, making summer work more bearable for the president. Movie theaters were among the first businesses to have air conditioning, drawing huge crowds. AC systems were luxury in the 1960s, now over 87% of US homes have them. AC uses refrigeration to cool air, the same principle your fridge uses to keep food cold. Romans had cooling system using aqueduct water circulating through walls of their homes. AC improves efficiency as workers perform better in comfortable environments. More energy is spent on AC in the US than the entire continent of Africa uses for all purposes. Modern AC uses chlorofluorocarbons which can harm the ozone layer if released. AC can filter out pollen, dust and other allergens from the air. The world's biggest AC is in Saudi Arabia and can call 20,000 people simultaneously. AC maintenance can reduce energy consumption by 15%. Early AC units used toxic gases like ammonia and methyl chloride. AC invention boosted population in US, southern states due to increased comfort. Without AC, modern computers would overheat, hindering technological progress. AC use peaks during 2 to 5 p.m., leading to higher energy prices. China is the largest market for air conditioners globally. Before AC, architects designed homes with high ceilings and breezeways for natural cooling. Energy-efficient AC can save up to 50% on your energy bill. The term summer blockbuster came because people flocked to AC movie theaters in summer. Ceiling fans and AC together can reduce energy consumption significantly. Japan has cool biz campaign encouraging workers to wear lighter clothes to reduce AC use. The automotive AC was introduced in the 1930s, but became popular in the 1950s. AC systems can also act as heaters during colder months. AC can reduce the risk of heat-related illnesses and deaths. An increase in AC demand in developing countries could strain global energy resources. The US uses more electricity on AC than all of Africa's electricity consumption combined. AC maintenance extends lifespan of the unit and ensures optimal performance. AC filters should be changed every one to three months for optimal air quality. AC drain lines can become clogged, leading to water damage in homes. AC doesn't bring in fresh air but recirculates indoor air. Proper insulation reduces AC workload and saves energy. Oversized AC units can result in inefficiency and higher costs. Modern AC uses less ozone-depleting substances than older models. SEER rating on AC indicates its energy efficiency. Higher is better. AC condenser units should be kept clear of debris for efficient operation. High humidity can decrease AC efficiency. Dehumidifiers help. AC units have a lifespan of 15 to 20 years with proper maintenance. Without AC, many medications would degrade faster in hot conditions. Smart AC units can be controlled remotely via smartphone apps. Setting thermostat 1 degree Fahrenheit higher can save 3 to 5% on cooling costs. Zoning systems can direct AC to specific rooms, saving energy. Dirty AC coils can reduce system efficiency by over 30%. Many AC units use UV lights to kill bacteria and mold. Turning off AC when away for extended periods can lead to mold growth. AC not only cools but also removes moisture, helping in humid conditions. Before central AC, window units were the primary means of cooling for many households. Some ACs use green refrigerants, which have a lower impact on the environment than traditional refrigerants. 
variable speed ACs adjust their output based on the cooling demand, making them more energy efficient.